almost there. Get out of my home! I am calling the police right now! <laughs> and that's what she said. So I am still on the waiting list for Mooch's must have exclusive sack. The very bag Mandy brought to school yesterday. Ouch! I know! It's just not fair. What's wrong, Alex? Are you in pain? Yeah, I have this raging toothache. Luckily, it only hurts when I eat, talk, or breathe. <laughs> Excuse me? Can we get back to the real crisis here? I mean, Mandy only got the bag because she bribed the sales clerk. Personally, I would never stoop so low. <gasps> uh, <laughs> speaking of stooping, why is Mandy taking the bus? Oh! For your information, I'm doing research for a term paper on public transportation. Oh. So far, I give it an F. The bus or your paper? Still jealous, huh? Guess some of us are exclusive people, and some of us aren't. <laughs> Am I hallucinating? Or is that Mandy eating a bologna sandwich? What are you looking at? It just so happens that I can't stand cafeteria food. Gives new meaning to the word grody. Uh, the cafeteria food is grody? She's the one who brought a bologna sandwich. Ow! At least she can eat. Alex, your tooth is probably infected. You need to see a dentist. Please, are you kidding? Last time Alex went to the dentist, she made a major impression on the dentist's hand. What do you expect? He was the one who stuck his hand in my mouth. Hello, kind of the point of going to the dentist. Hmm. Okay, this is getting weird. You see Mandy's sweater? It's exactly like the one I just donated to the designer clothes for the needy charity drive. You don't <laughs> think that instead of shopping on Rodeo Drive, Mandy's shopping on Charity Drive? There's only one way to be sure. My sweater has my initials on it. You still put your initials on your clothes? What are we, in kindergarten? I'll have you know monogramming is all the rage. Uh, yep, that is definitely my old sweater. First the bus, then the bologna sandwich, now this? Could Mandy be totally broke? Good afternoon, ladies. What is with the robot with the chip on his shoulder, Jer? You girls really must brush up on your martial arts skills. Whoops, new training robot beat you in less than 10 seconds. Sorry, we've been too busy actually saving the world to practice saving it. Ow! You really should see a dentist about that tooth, Alex. It's pointless trying to talk to her, Jer. We've been telling her that all day. Oh. Several notable people have gone missing in the past two days. The CEO of a multinational bank, Mia Hansen, the actress, and Myra Sokoloff. Famous ice skater? The very one. They've disappeared without a trace, but what's most puzzling is there doesn't seem to be any connection between them. I'm just cross-referencing them now. Huh. That's weird. What's weird? Jerry's almost right. Hmm? There's no connection between them except one. They all go to the same dentist. A Dr. Logan J. See? Going to the dentist was their first mistake. Ow! Today you'll get the Wind Tunnel 9000 Laser Tornado Blast Hair Dryer, the Hologram Projection Mood Ring, and the Laser Nail File. Good luck on your mission, ladies. 
Forget it, Jer. We're not falling for that again. Ah! Whoa! Don't even think about it or I'll sell you for parts, you jive bucket of circuits. Who ah! oh! exactly did we change into disguises for? The rats? Let's split up. See what we can find. Yuck! Please tell me these were the befores, not the afters. Wow, Dr. J sure had some famous clients. <laughs> is it my imagination, or does that rat sound like it's laughing? I don't know, but we better send the gas to Jerry for analysis. <laughs> Something tells me you failed this part of nursing school. <laughs> Great, more toys. <laughs> Muscles like that anywhere. There's no way out. Sam's trapped. Luckily, I have the hologram projecting the mood ring. Hang on, Sam. Ha! Now try to figure out which Sam is the real one. Great thinking, Alex. <laughs> what else I can dig up on him while you try to find Sam. We can't track Sam because she dropped her X powder in the fight. I may be able to help there. Twelve dollars is my final offer. Take it or leave it. Is Mandy having a yard sale? <gasps> not just any yard sale, a Beverly Hills yard sale. If that's not a sign Mandy's in financial trouble, then I don't know what is. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, Mandy's selling her exclusive sack for 20 bucks. <laughs> Let's see how low Miss Desperado will go. Hey, Mandy. I'll give you 50 cents for the bag. Please. You know the exclusive sack is worth a thousand <gasps> times that. Are you having some kind of financial trouble? Don't be ridiculous. I'm just getting rid of a few things to make room for all the new fall stuff I've ordered. Do you want the bag or not? Mandy! You're not allowed to talk to your friends! That is what being grounded means! Grounded? Please! These are so not my friends! No but, young lady! You will get your master platinum back and your freedom when those grades improve! No! Up to your room! So that explains it. Mandy's not broke, her credit's been cut off. I can't believe I'm going to say this, but poor Mandy. That's like majorly severe punishment. <laughs> Thanks for nothing, Jer. I had my eye on a rad faux feather boa. I could have got it for a quarter and a pocket full of lint. Hmm? Don't ask. Any news on Sam? 
Just what I was trying to tell you before I just launched my new Biorhythm satellite. It can track Sam's unique physical signature anywhere in the world. It's fully compatible with your X powders. Check it out! Sam's in Paris! This mission just got a whole lot cooler. Oh, except for the part where our best friend's been abducted. <laughs> hey! Where'd Alex go? Just give me one second to kick this hunk of metal's butt back to the scrap heap. <laughs> Don't feel bad, Alex. Whoop made sure our training robot was virtually undefeatable. Every time I'm kidnapped, the bad guy takes me to some dank hole in the middle of nowhere. <sighs> How come I never get Paris? is directly below us in the penthouse suite. We're gonna have to bungee in. Ow! You know what? If you don't go to the dentist soon, I'm going to bungee that tooth right out of your mouth. All right, all right, I'll go. doing in the apartment of world-renowned model Dunstan Cruz? Okay, Spill. How do you know that? Oh, uh, well, there's this completely illegal but completely gnarly gossip scene that puts out a celebrity apartments hmm. of the world issue every year. You should really check it out. Ah! <laughs> <gasps> I take it back. You can bungee my tooth out anytime. I'm never going to the dentist again. Oh, don't worry, beautiful Dunstan. We'll rescue you. I wouldn't be so sure. <laughs> Clover! <laughs> Quick, unstick me before we become more nerves. <laughs> Hey, aren't you Mia Hansen from that terrible romantic comedy, Dude, Where's My Date? They can't all be box office smashes. Way to make the crazy lady with dentures angry, Clover! Clover, watch out! than okay. I'm great! Hey! I can't see! I can't see! Oh, I think Sam left the bleach on a little too long. <gasps> Sis, when does Sam work for the bad guy? <laughs> be controlling their minds, turning them into crazed dental assistants. And the chair must be changing them physically, giving them strange oral powers. <laughs> ah, there's only one thing worse than dentists. <laughs> or the dentist. <laughs> I guess Dustin can say sayonara to his modeling career. Welcome to my lair. My lair? Is in your old office? How lame. Looks like someone has a cavity. 
It really must go. But it will have to wait. I have more important things to do right now. In my old practice, cosmetic dentist to the stars, I could make anyone smile picture perfect. It's all I ever wanted to do until... What? Until what? It wasn't my fault. The president didn't follow my instructions. He left my patented whitening solution on too long and it ate through his teeth. He had my license revoked. <laughs> but now I'm back for revenge. Ah, oh, always with the revenge. Soon everyone in the entire world will be dental freaks under my control. To the chopper. <gasps> Luckily, I'm here to finish what Dr. J started. This should make you nice and sleepy. Uh, I feel woozy. If only I had the laser nail file. I don't know what she put up my nose, but my tooth feels way better. While we call Jerry. Girls, the gas analysis is complete. It's a modified laughing gas capable of controlling minds. Okay, as far as updates go, that one's about a week too late, Jer. Is there an antidote? I'll send it through right away. Hmm. Where am I? What's going on? And more importantly, why am I hogtied on this nasty, dirty floor? We'll explain later. Right now, we have to stop Dr. J. He already has a 20-minute head start. Then use this. Cool. Thanks, Jer. Any sign of Dr. J yet? Not yet, but I'm betting he doesn't exactly want to be found. There he is! He's a thousand feet down! Almost directly below us! <laughs> That's some fancy flying, Sam! Get them! <laughs> Taking these dental freaks for a ride! Ugh. Forget them, Sam! We have to bail out now! <laughs> Just tell me, when do I get to rescue people from a nice day at the spa? <laughs> This one's mine. No more machines are going to get the better of Alex today. Yeah! yeah! Way to show the chair who's boss, Alex. Alex? What is she doing? That's the thing about technology. It always comes with an off switch. <sighs> Wait! If he's in here, then who's flying the chopper? <laughs> <laughs> You man the controls! Alex and I will take care of Dr. J! <laughs> I'm on it! Not so fast, Dr. J! <sighs> Impressive moves, ladies. Looks like our new training robot paid off after all. And thanks for curing my toothache, Dr. J. 
Whatever was in that anesthesia really worked. <laughs> I'm really glad I'm no longer blinding people with my smile. But I wish oh. they'd shrink back to normal size a little quicker. This bag once again restores my status as the undisputed fashionista of Beverly Hills. <laughs> Though I do feel kind of bad that it only cost me 50 cents. You could always pay Mandy what it's worth. Hello, who said anything about feeling that bad? <gasps> I passed my chemistry midterm! Welcome back, Master Platinum! Oh, and thanks for taking that tacky thing off my hands. <laughs> I just ordered Mucha's new Aristo sag. It should be here any minute via Mega Hyper Express Mail. Oh, here it is now. <laughs> oh, but the Aristo sack isn't even supposed to be out until next season. Oh, it's just not fair. Look at the bright side. You have one thing Mandy will never be able to buy. Real oh. friends. <laughs> You're right. You guys are the best. As a rule, teenage girls are most perplexing, but I truly don't understand Alex at all. I've seen her face evil head-on, leap from supersonic jets, and even step between Clover and Mandy when things get out of control. But the first mention of a dentist and she flees. I reckon she's being completely irrational. Speaking of which, Jerry, isn't it time for your checkup? Oh my 